Welcome back to the channel, HB RV Lifestyle. This is your honey badger here, giving it to you straight in the RV business as usual. But today, we're gonna go on a fishing trip. We're at Lake Sabrina in Bishop, California. This is probably one of my favorite places to come and trout fish. It has been a mainstay of my childhood, mainstay of my adulthood. I love renting a boat, float tubing. So this weekend, I'm gonna show you everything that is absolutely amazing about this lake, even though it is under new ownership. Bring them up. Open over. Yeah, good job. Whoop, put in that. Good job. See, he was there. Good job. You know, some of the childhood memories I have at this lake is that I was actually stung by a bee at four years old, had my eye just so swollen because I was allergic to him. And, <laughs> you know, I kept on fishing, kept on catching trout, having a good time, having a blast. And I've actually tried to pass that on to my kids. Um, you know, it may be windy as all with Jesus today, but on a normal morning, it's calm, it's quiet, and very enjoyable. Vader. Vader. Vader the trout. Sorry, Vader the trout, but you are not being eaten this time. There he goes. Good job, Joanna. Thank you. It's pending. It's okay. Pending? Hold on. I know. One at a time. Ooh, that's a bigger one. Okay, come over this side, sweetheart. Bring him over here. Bring him over here. That's actually... Ooh, whoa, let him... Come bring him back. There you go. Ah, that's a keeper. Good job, Jojo. Okay, Brenda, go ahead and set your hook. You remember how to set it? Very gently. Mama's got one now. Bring him over. Ooh, he's a big one. It's okay. Oh, he's the biggest one we've had today. Bring him up this way. Bring him up this way. Here you go. No, 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 don't drop him. Now, one of the very sad parts about this lake is that over the last probably four or five years, the level of the lake has gone down dramatically. They're not getting the snowpack that they usually get up in the high, high mountain areas by all the high, you know, Blue Lake and Donkey Lake. So the lake is not as full as it used to be. In fact, I'm gonna turn around here and show you that those actually were the docks when I was a kid. So that shows you over the last probably 30 years, this lake has gone down in water level. But just like everybody, we all adapt. So here's an adaption that they have come up with where they actually have this beautiful private dock where you actually get to rent these pontoon boats and the little eight mile an hour, 15 mile an hour little boats to go fishing all the way down at the end, other end of the lake near the inlets. Okay, 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 I'll take the net. I think that Here, is your Oh, he's kind of puny. He's puny. Yeah, he's puny. Let's see if I can see him. Okay, pull him up. Bring him all towards me. Bring him towards me. Bring him towards me. There you go, perfect. Good job. Right on time. 